Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Tori and we're at the Flower and Garden Festival at Epcot. So we last left off on Twitter and I was showing you the uh, Peter Pan and Captain Hook. Hello, oh, welcome. I'm Tori. Hi everyone. So this is Captain Hook and Peter Pan. Would you mind taking a picture of all of us? Now we're heading into France. Good morning, Melanie. Can you hear me better? Hi, Tim. I'm Tori. So right now we are going into France at the Flower and Garden Festival. On Twitter, we saw Winnie the Pooh, Tigger, we saw butterflies, we saw Piglet. Hi, Margie. Hello, welcome. So like I said, right now we are going to France. I'm good, how are you today? It's a little windy in Florida. And I'm a native Florida. Pretty close to the So we are currently in France now, and if you ever come to France, you have to try the macaroons. They are so good. Hi, I have never been to Canada, nor have I ever seen snow. So. So here is the review from France. Oh, New York. I'm wearing a New York shirt right now. I love New York. I was just up there. It's my favorite place in the world. So as you can see, you can kind of see the Eiffel Tower that Disney did. And my favorite food with like the festivals, the food and wine and stuff. I'm absolutely in love with everything from France. If you come for food and wine, you have to try the beef bourguignon, I think it's what it's called, I'm not really sure. You're from Illinois, I'm from Florida. <laughs> and so, like I said, we're in France. And it's absolutely beautiful. There's not really much in France for the Flower and Garden Festival itself, but they do have some beautiful flowers. And they have, you can see the stand right there, um, a local produce. The weather, um, it's very sunny, very hot, but we do have some wind coming through every now and then, which is pretty good. And where are we now? I'm not really good at telling the places in World Showcase. But here's one of the towers. Canada is one of the places on my bucket list to go to. I definitely want to go to Canada. And I want to see Niagara Falls and, you know, where my family grew up. I 
think we're in Morocco because I know that there's two, there's one place in Disney of all Disney to get henna, and this is it, and it's in Morocco. So I think we're in Morocco. Now heading into Japan, I'm pretty sure. Welcome everyone, I'm Tori. Good morning, Jerry. Here is... You got engaged in Niagara Falls? That's so cute. So, I'm honestly not sure what I use. It is a stabilizer, I know that. But it's my parents. On Twitter, we went on Imagination with Figment, and once we just complete the circle, we're going on the seas with Nemo and friends. Hi, Darla. It is a nice day. Unfortunately, I'm wearing a sweatshirt and leggings because that's always what I wear and it's you know it's horrible in 80 degree weather so we're in Japan now and my family and I once came and had sushi at this one place and it was amazing it's beautiful and the sushi was so good now here's the view from Japan. Ooh, Pennsylvania. I always want to go to Pennsylvania. My brother's from there. My nephews live there. My sister lives there. <laughs> Here's the American Pavilion where I have seen Plain White Tees, I've seen American Authors, and tonight it's Little River Band. Hello from the tr I'm Florida. I could smell the final clips. Now over here, this is something my mom is going to love. If she hasn't seen it already. I was walking by and I just saw it. This is Woody. A snowstorm. Yesterday we had a rainstorm and we were on tornado <laughs> warning. No, watch. And he is the American Adventure. Oh, I want to go to the United Kingdom so bad. Good afternoon, Michael. For all of you just joining, I'm Tori. Is the American Experience so close to the British one? Um, no, there's people going in, so they're back open. Another full wonder another wonderful day in Florida. Yesterday was not so wonderful. We were on tornado war watch. I keep mixing that up. So we are halfway around the World Showcase. Wait, this is America. And after the World Showcase, we are going to go on the scene with Nemo and friends.
I believe we're walking into Norway. I'm not sure though, or Italy. Hi, Jerry. Yes, the weather is absolutely beautiful today. And it's the first full day of spring, so thank I'm so thankful. So I think this is Italy. Yeah, this is Italy. And if you come to Italy, you have to try the pizza. It is so good. So back there is a restaurant, pizza restaurant, and it's amazing. And they have the biggest pizza I've ever seen. And my family and I finished it in like 10 minutes. Here's where you can get gelato. Yes, the pizza I did up is amazing. The gelato is really good here. When we got pizza, we got pepperoni and olives, and that, those are my two favorites. And it's so good. Here is my favorite, the Seven Doors and Snow White. Here's Snow White. Seven Dwarfs especially remind me of my grandpa whose nickname was Grumpy. Norway, I'm pretty sure, and this is where the Frozen Ever After is. If you guys haven't been on Frozen Ever After, you have to go on it. You have to go on it at least once. Yeah, it is very windy. And I have long hair, so it's kind of hard. Oh, we're in Germany. Okay, thank you. And you have to try the sauerkraut. If you don't like sauerkraut, that's on you, but the sauerkraut here is amazing. Like I said earlier, I'm not really good at knowing where this, which is what in the World Showcase. Germany. temperature it's around hmm, 75 76 maybe hotter hi Lori ever come to Epcot and you don't want to go in this world ship piece of food, you should definitely go to the electric umbrella. And I am a meat eater, I love meat, but the vegetarian flatbread is amazing. Welcome. I can't really have the beer because I'm under 21, but I'm sure that my parents would agree with you. The country is beautiful. Oh yes, you should definitely plan the trip. 
when it is flower and garden or food and food and wine. It's they're both so beautiful. And now we're crossing into China. It's amazing how they take the atmosphere of each country and can put it in one place. Good morning to Northern at California. I'm going to California this July and I'm super excited. It's going to be my first time at Disneyland. We just got back to New York, New York. I said this earlier, but New York is my favorite place in the world. I absolutely love it, and I saw Wicked like last month, and oh my god, it's amazing. Have fun in September. A pint of beer. <laughs> Looks like a beautiful, it is a beautiful afternoon. Here's China. In 2020, definitely. I definitely want to go back to New York. I, I was just there February 9th for the 11th, and I'm trying to convince my mom to go again. And now we are crossing over to where Frozen Ever After is, I'm pretty sure, which gets very, very busy. I've seen the light. I've seen the line all the way up to here. Yep, this is where Frozen Ever After is in a Kirsch's Hall, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Kirsch's restaurant. And then there's Frozen Ever After in the back. That is inspired by Frozen, the movie, and they just, it's just an amazing ride. You have to go on it at least once. Yeah, Florida is, I've lived here my entire life. And I don't see myself living in any other state. Here is, speaking of Frozen, here's Anna and Elsa. And here's where you can meet on an Elsa. I'm not sure what school bread is either. <laughs> when is what the bit open? Frozen after after has been open for I think over a year. Here's on an Elsa. Ever after opened two years ago, no one makes sense. And now we're crossing over into Mexico. My friend is from Calgary. If you come to Mexico, you have to try the nachos. It is over here. I don't know. Where were we when we sprayed the Okay. Here we go. 
show. Um, this is where you should try the nachos in Mexico. And there is Tesh Shot, that building right here. Yeah, Bob, we got it figured out. Yeah, you definitely want to go when it's quiet out. Here is, I forget what they're called. The food club I am. Is it what it's called? Yeah, um, on Monday, my friend and I went to all three parks except, we went to all parks except Epcot. And I went on Top Tier once and Rock and Roll Coaster about six times. The most I've ever been on is seven. Here's the bowling basket. I definitely want to try the bowling basket. The sun is very bright today, but it's fine because the wind just cancels it out. And you can barely feel the sun. There's Pluto. left around the entire world showcase. What stabilizer? I'm not sure. You're gonna have to ask Bob. It's his. I'm not sure if he's still watching. Yep, he's still watching. You can ask Bob or Dee. It's theirs. And we just completed the whole showcase and now we're off to the seas. The Nemo and friends. This is Nemo and friends. I'm sure it's called. Yes. I didn't say anything to me. You don't know. So it's called the smooth Q stabilizer. Like I said, if you're ever in Epcot, you have to try the electric umbrella if you do not want to eat at the World Showcase. It is so good. And I got the world the. Which you, what is it called? The vegetarian flatbread. And oh my gosh, I love me, but oh my gosh, it was so good. And now I thank my parents every time when we come back to go there. Yeah, so basically, for it is beautiful flowers. Earlier, I was on Twitter and we went on a journey into imagination with Figment and we did the fast pass because standby right now was 40 minutes long. I've never seen it that long. And here's Figment. The garden grill. Is that where living with the land is? I have not tried the garden grill yet. Honestly, I'm not sure who I'm filming this for. Um, you, you'd have to ask uh, Ian or Bob. I'm really not sure. But today I woke up and I decided to go stream because it was going to be a beautiful day out. I think I might stream on Sunday too, just because they're slow on Sundays and I can go on rides.
And over there is the electric umbrella. Hard to, it's always hard to be, yes. It's crazy. What, where are you where? I'm at Epcot. And right now we're going to the sea with Nemo and friends. Yes, I'm glad we stayed safe too. Um, it was storming, and Bob was home. My mom was at work. I like the Starbucks at Hollywood Studios just because nobody knows it's there, so it is always quiet. Up ahead is living at the land. There is Journey to Imagination. And here's the seas with Nemo and friends. How about some Beverly? Mm, I don't think I'm going to do that today. Yeah, I've, I already went on Figment on Twitter, and right now it's around a 40 minute wait. Right now the seas with Nemo in front is 30 minutes. But luckily, we have a fast pass. So you can hear them say mine. My name is Tori. I'm new to streaming the magic. I just joined. I love this part too, my favorite part. Thank you. And depending where Bob is going on Friday, I might just be with him. Yes, I'm brand new to streaming the magic. Um, my mom is on streaming the magic, and my mom is engaged to Bob. So, I'm gonna be going to other parks. I might, but I definitely want to eat after I'm done with this broadcast. Because I have not gotten to eat today. I'm having a wonderful day. I woke up 
got ready to shower. No, I definitely want to see it. But not while it's in a snowstorm. So if you guys have any questions about any Disney ride, I've been on every Disney ride except for Cali River Rapids then you can definitely ask. And I've been on both Pandora rides, so. Haha, <laughs> thank you. Please send some snow my way. It might be melted when it gets here, though. Definitely gonna try and stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Sunday. Um, yes, I'm a student. Um, I go to a school nearby. It's like 10 minutes away from Nuts Kingdom, so. My absolute favorite ride is Rock and Roller Coaster with Aerosmith. New York is my favorite place in the world. I want to go soon. I'll try not to talk too much while I'm on this ride, mostly because um, you guys should be able to watch. Yes, definitely. Just add me on Facebook and I'll add you right back. And yeah, my mom is the pervert, and she's also a streamer. Okay, thanks for that warning. I have 
I'm not good on this one. Such a long time. We've been on a huge adventure together, which you don't remember at all. Is he armed with white stripes and looks kind of like you, only smaller? Yes, have you seen him? Seen who? <sighs> Hi, I'm Dory. I am looking for my son. Ooh, I can help you. <laughs> <laughs> Total Talk with Crush, we're going to do that. It's a 15 minute wait. Not too bad.
let's do this later. Let's see what time it is. Let's do this now, and then after this, after this, we can end the broadcast. Thank you, Jessica. Oh, really? 
too good right now. <laughs> other things. Talk with Crush, and then afterwards, we're going to end this broadcast. The electric umbrella. I love the electric umbrella. Yeah, make 
guys have any questions, just let me know and I can answer them. Or you could have a question to ask Crush.
car, so we should be going in any second. People are leaving. for Turtle Talk with Crush. as well as mine. I'd like to keep the center aisle clear as well as the two side aisles. Anyone standing up on the side, you can join your children on the green seagrass or on the green sea benches. If you need to exit for any reason, one or two, either double door will lead you right back to our aquarium sea base area. So if you need to exit, give it one gentle plush explorers. All right, good afternoon everyone. Welcome to Turtle Talk. My name is Anna, and just before we begin today, I do have a few reminders to go over with you guys. Here at Seabase, there will please be no eating, no drinking, no smoking, and no flash photography. Oh, thanks guys. This device here, we call it a hydrophone. It's going to help listen to sounds beneath the sea, and today it's going to help us hear from our special guest. Anyone knows that is? Go ahead, help me out by shouting it out. Crush! That is right, it is Crush. Crush is coming to the human world to ask us some questions, and we can ask him some questions about the turtle world. So, everyone think of a question you may get to ask Crush, okay? It seems like Crush is out surfing, but let's call by shouting, Hey Crush, on the count of three, ready? One, two, three. Hey Crush! Check it out, dude. 
It's totally the 360 foot. Into the front side, indeed. Very old, dude. Awesome. Whoa, check out all the human dudes in the human tank. Hello, dudes. Hello. Let's totally try that again. I said hello. these dudes so let's start over on this side little dude going towards the end gray shell let's talk to this dude Ooh. I'll follow you what's your name dude Brandon all right Brandon are you having a good day today yep do me a favor dude say totally Totally. <laughs> now say, sweet. Sweet. <laughs> now put the two together and say, totally sweet. Totally sweet. <laughs> totally put your bins together for the Brenda News. Totally talking turtle. How about we all try a totally sweet on three? Ready? One, two, three. Let's see who else we got. Let's slide to the center. Do that. Extra gears. Hello, what's your name? Darren. Nice to meet you, Darren. Are you having fun today? Yeah. Little one, where are you from? I'm from Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Awesome. So how did you get here? Where is mom? Raise the fin. Let's go talk to her. Because she totally didn't think she was talking to a turtle today. Hello, what's your name? Jessica. Nice to meet you, Jessica. So that's your little one up front there? Yes. Isn't it great teaching them the ways of the world, Mom Jessica? Yes. <laughs> you know what? We totally just shared a moment, dude. <laughs> Because I totally have the offspring myself, little squirt dude. And he's always asking questions about you human dudes. So I was wondering if all of you could help me out. Help answer some of Squirt's questions. If you could do that for me, everyone say, Chaw. Chaw. All right, dudes, I shall totally get right to it. I'll get on to Squirt's question. Beam around, you know. Now, little squirt dude sees you humans at the beach. And he was like, Yo, Dad, what do the human dudes do at the beach? And uh, I was like, I do not know. <laughs> so, what do you dudes do when you're at the beach? Shout it out, I'll totally hear you. What do you do? Swim, Crashman totally likes to swim. And I think I'm pretty fast. So I'll go for one. All you dudes all time me, okay? Yeah. I'll let you know when to start counting. Gotta rev up the motor first. Alright, get ready everybody. Start counting now.
little dude serves up. Thanks a lot, Crush. For what, dude? The turtle party. <laughs> you just said it again, dude. <laughs> he totally loves that game. Well, dudes, I've been asking you all the questions. Do any of you have a question for the Crush Man? Or just about sea turtles? Totally raise the fin if you have a question for me. Let's start on this side, little dude. Great shell, fit up. What's your name, bro? Matthew. All right, Matthew, go for it. I was wondering what you do with Squirt all day. Oh, dude, we have an awesome time. In fact, one of the favorite things is a game we like to play called Hide and Seek. If you dudes have heard of a game called Hide and Seek, say, chomp. You want to play hide and seek with the crush man? Say, show. All right, I shall hide. You do shall seek. So everyone close your eyes. Turn your phones off. <laughs> All right, we got it. All right, close your eyes. Now, count to three. That's not me. <laughs> ah, you totally found me. You dudes are awesome at the hide and seek. Let's get another question. Riz up the fan. Up front on this side. Little dudette. Like a red shell. There we go. What's your name? Holly. And what's your question for me? Can you swim? Can I swim? They say up to 20 miles per hour. But between me and you, Holly? I think I can break the speed record, so I'm going for it. It's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna see it here first. Crushman breaking the speed record, dude. Check it out, 18, 19. Whoa, that was a bummer, dude. Hey, Crush, watch out for the glass. Oh, thanks, Hank. Dude. How long has he been there? Awesome. I'm learning a lot from you dudes. And there's knowledge. Hey, touch me. Hey, come back here. Dude, Destiny and Little Blue. Dudettes, come back and say hello. the human dudes? Maybe we can teach them something, like speak well. Destiny could teach them. She oh, taught me. If only she were here. Uh, I am here. Wow! Well, that's freaky. Okay, everybody, repeat after me. Hello, Catch up to squirt. But before I go, 
I'll leave you with some knowledge I've learned in my many years. Be good to the ocean. She will totally be good to you. Hey, little dudes and dudettes. Keep using the word dude all day. Your parents will totally love it. <laughs> I'll catch you later. Rock on, dude. Hey, let's give it up for Crush. <laughs> if you guys would like to see more Crush's friends, you can head up to our undersea view mirror, local on the second floor. Little ones, please stay seated until a friendly man comes to get you. Gather all person belongings, including your children, and exit to the open doors on your right. For your safety, there's no standing, walking, climbing on the benches as you exit. Thanks for coming, guys. Enjoy the rest of your evening here at Epcot. Alright, so that's it for this broadcast. I hope you guys enjoy. Um, I think I'll be broadcasting on Sunday again my own story. I hope you guys enjoy the broadcast. Bye!